morning everyone today i am going to teach you a new topic children can guess what is that topic here which can fly in the sky it has beak wings feathers and light body it can fly easily can say what is the children it has beak wings and feathers what is that yes it's bird children today we are going to know about birds where do we live children we live in the house we live in the house children like birds can live in the nest birds can live in the nest birds can make the nest on the tree birds can make the nest on the tree now let us know about birds see this is peacock peacock is the one of the most beautiful bird one of the most beautiful bird children can see what is the most beautiful bird yes peacock is the most beautiful bird it has a long tail it has a long tail like colorful peacock is a national bird children what is our national bird peacock peacock is our national bird and can dance in the rain and dance in the rain they cannot fly they cannot fly to long distance children what is our national bird peacock let us see this bird this is parrot this is parrot parrot is a green color bird parrot is a green color bird with a red beak and red band around its neck parrot can talk like us what is the green color bird children parrot parrot is a green color bird with a red beak parrot has red beak this is sparrow see here children what is this this is sparrow sparrow is a small bird see children what is the color of the sparrow brown black and gray in color see children it can see we can see here near our surroundings we can see the sparrow near our surround this is owl owl has big eyes owl has big eyes it's eagle eagle is a strong bird eagle is a strong bird because it can fly so high it can fly so high it has big head children it can see long distance it can see long distance this is called woodpecker what is this children woodpecker it makes the holes to the tree bark it makes the holes to the tree bark to find the insect for food children it makes the holes to the tree bark to find insects for food children these are ducks these are ducks ducks lives in the pond this is called pigeon it has a gray color feathers it has a gray color feathers with a shiny green neck band with a shiny green neck band they makes nest on the tree children this is hummingbird hummingbird is a smallest bird what is the smallest bird children hummingbird this is called flamingo what is this this is flamingo it has long legs it has long legs it is bulbul bulbul is a sweet singing bird bulbul is a sweet singing bird it has rounded wings and long tail this is called crane this is called crane it has a long neck 
children see here it has a long neck and long leg called crane this is swan swan lives in the water what is this swan this is called myna this is called myna what is this bird children myna this is called crow this is called crow see children what is the color of the crow black in color black in color children here we can see the bird crow every day crow makes the sound how is the crow makes the sound cow 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 crow makes the sound cow 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 see children do you know crow is the intelligent bird crow is the intelligent bird why children we can say the crow is the intelligent bird yes there is a story children there is a story on the intelligence of the crow do you want to know what is the story listen everyone one sunny day a thirsty crow saw a pot of water he saw a pot of water here thirsty crow crow is a so thirsty thirsty means feel to drink water feel drink water who wants to drink water children here crow wants to drink water he looked in the into the pot and saw only a little water in the pot he saw a little water in the pot now crow is thinking how to get the water to up to drink then he got an idea he got an idea to get the water to up he looked around he looked around he saw some stones he dropped the stones one by one in the pot into the pot he dropped the stones into the pot one by one children what is the idea of the crow yes he picked some stones and dropped stones into the pot one by one then the stones went into the down the water came up say everyone what is went down stones stones went down what is came up the water came up now crow drank the water and flew away happily children this is about the story who is intelligent here children crow is the intelligent children what is the moral of the story think and work hard you may find solution to any problem what is the moral of the story children think and work hard you may find solution to any problem children today our assignment is learn birds name some birds and share your work in whatsapp thank you children i hope you understand this video